What's up, Sealant? Bringing you guys some cool new tech for 2021. Uh, we're able now to connect to the rotor hazard timer from your mobile devices, whether that's a cell phone, a laptop, even a tablet. Uh, you'll be able to access the rotor hazard directly from your device, check out all the race data, figure out what time, what your uh, channel you're supposed to be on. You'll also be able to get messages directly from me, like if it's your time to uh, go out to the starting blocks and race, other things like channel changes. Really cool stuff. So um, I'm going to go through the menus. Here we go. Check it out. All right, guys, this is what you got to do if you want to access the rotor hazard timer from your mobile device. It's pretty simple. Go to your settings page. Once you're in your settings page, go to connections, turn your Wi-Fi on, search for the SELA network. Once you see the network, go ahead and log into it. There is no password, so it should be uh, straightforward. Once you're logged in, you can go back to your web browser and you're going to type in the rotor hazard URL. That URL is 192.168.1.1. Once you have that URL, go ahead and go to it, and that's going to take you to the rotor hazard timer. I'm going to try to find a good place to put this URL so we don't forget, uh, and it's pretty easy for everyone to access. So once you're into the rotor hazard uh, timer, uh, the important things that you're going to be using is event heats and classes and viewing the race results. Um, if you go to event heats and classes, this will basically tell you the um, overall format for the day. I'll try to do a good job of keeping this up to date and accurate for each race day. If you scroll back, you can go to view race results. That's going to show your event leaderboards, your qualifying, and then your practice rounds. Uh, and if you go into there, you can see all the detailed data uh, and actually the data from each individual race. So that's a really, really cool feature. Uh, another cool feature, if you go into the menu setting in the top right-hand corner, click on stream displays, and, and then click current race results, you'll be able to see the live, the live data from the actual race that's going on. So for example, if I start a race now, you'll see it come up on your device. And from there, you can see everything as it's actually happening. All right, I'm going, I'm gonna go ahead and stop this race here and scroll back to our main page. Um, another really cool feature is that if I need to send out a notification to the pilots uh, to let you guys know like when it's time to race, uh, anything specific that we need to do, I can send a message, which will be a like a pop-up icon that's going to come up on your device. Uh, it's really cool. So this, for example, uh, if it was time for Heat 1 to go to the starting blocks, I can announce it over the microphone and then also send you guys a message, which will come up as a, an alert. So everybody would get this to their device to let them know, you know, wh where we're at in the race. And then um, I can send, you know, all different kind of things, whatever I need to send to you guys. So I think it's super cool. I'm super excited about this new feature from Rotor Hazard. And I'm really looking forward to the 2021 uh, race season. All right. See you guys at the races.